Chicago Bulls signed Jalen Smith to a three-year, $27 million deal. So he could decline his player option with the Pacers. And he saw his playing time was going nowhere with Indiana. He gets $9 million a year, which is a solid deal, deal to be a backup over there in Chicago unless they slide him in at the powered forward position. So last season, 9.9 points a game. Five and a half boards and assists, one three and 59% from the field. So those are good numbers as a reserve. But into the playoffs, he didn't really see the court much where Isaiah Jackson got those meaningful backup minutes at the powered forward center position and Obi Toppin, obviously, for the Indiana Pacers. And now he moves on to Chicago. Like I said, he'll possibly be starting powered forward or a backup to Vukovic. In terms of fantasy basketball, more of a deep league type of player Jalen Smith's going to be. But he's a former lottery pick in the top 15 for the Phoenix Suns a few seasons ago but now obviously he got traded to Indiana and now signs on with the Chicago Bulls and he got a good contract no doubt about it and now he's going to get playing time anywhere from 15 to the 25 minute range I believe so Jalen Smith cashes in a nice contract after last season had a good year with the Indiana Pacers and we'll see what he could do with the Chicago Bulls and possibly have some fantasy value entering the 2024-25 season.